Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing a vlog style video with you. Please keep in mind this is my very first vlog style video so it might not be the best but I'll keep practicing. Um, yesterday me and my mom went down to Lakewood which is about an hour and a half or so from us. So it's not a place we normally go to but I had won a gift card from O'Toole's Garden Center. So $100 in free plants, I couldn't pass that. So that's what we did yesterday, we drove down there. Um, it was a really nice place. I would totally go back or recommend it to those who live nearby. They had many different varieties of things, lots of plants and flowers. I mostly went to get vegetables for my garden. So here you can see we're picking out some tomatoes and um, some peppers. We got zucchini and cucumbers. This fall I really want to try and pickle some cucumbers along with some other stuff and make salsas and homemade tomato sauces from my own tomatoes out of my garden. So I'm excited to grow those and see how those work. Um, I also picked up, I think, I'm trying to think, what else did I get? I got some, oh I got some artichokes and some beets. The beets I'm going to try to use to dye some things. Um, here's a selection of all the different pepper plants they had. They had quite a few different varieties. I ended up going with some hot ones like serranos and jalapenos as well as a couple bell peppers and a sweet banana pepper. Here's another shot of some of the things I picked up along with some other things they have to offer at the garden center. These roses right here were so beautiful. They're like probably the prettiest roses I've ever seen. I really wanted to buy one, but each bucket was $50 and I really didn't have a plan or 100% of an idea of where I wanted to put them. So I passed on those, but they are so pretty. If you are in the Denver area, I'd really recommend you checking out that garden center if you're looking for a nice rose bush. Oh, so pretty. Those ones look like roses you could just cut and put in a vase. They're very, very nice. Some pink ones. But still those striped ones were great. So there's me loading them all back into the car. I ended up spending around $200. So actually in the end I only had to spend about $100 because I had the $100 gift card. Then here we are back at my house. And this is my new raised bed garden that we just put in this year. It is made from a pallet that transported... Uh, wind turbine parts. That's my mom planting some tomatoes. Did not get her but her arm on the video because she did not want to be included in the video. And then here I am planting my little peppers. This is basically from my little salsa garden over here. And as you can see I never wear gloves when I garden because I like to be able to feel the plants and it's hard to do that when you have big bulky gloves so it's always nice to have a nail brush on hand when you go inside to get all the nail out from under or all the nail all the dirt out from under your nails I went ahead and stuck the little what each plant was so I could mark it down on my garden what I planted this year but I probably won't keep those out all summer long I'm really loving how these raised garden beds turned out they were ten dollars for each little section and then we put in a fence so all the rabbits didn't eat it and then here are all my little herb gardens. I did oregano and parsley, basil, cilantro, as well as down in a bucket I planted two big bunches of, um, if you want to call it rosemary, it's not rosemary, lavender, which I hope gets nice and big. And then there you can see we added some cute little Edison bulb lights to the garden fence. I'll have to show those in a separate video at night. I didn't get any footage of them. And there's some zucchinis and our little pickling cucumbers. And our tomatoes are in the back there. And that's where I put all the peppers, some beets, and my artichoke. I don't know. I only got one artichoke. I don't know how big it'll grow or how good it'll do. So that's my video for today. Thanks for watching. I hope you come back and please subscribe and give this video a like. Thanks so much. Bye.